I'm so glad to see you today. Did you know that God loves you so much that He sent His Son Jesus to be your friend forever? It's true. There is no better friend than Jesus. Who wants to be your friend forever? Jesus wants to be my friend forever. Yes, He does. I know He loves me. Let's sing this together. No matter what, no matter what, Jesus loves me. Jesus is there no matter what. The Bible teaches us that Jesus said, I am with you always. In the Bible, Matthew 28, 20. Can you say it with me? I am with you always. Open up your Bible, Matthew 28, 20. Jesus is my friend. This I know for sure. One more time. Who wants to be your friend forever? Jesus wants to be my friend forever. Today's story is about a surprise breakfast, but they didn't eat bacon and eggs. No, they ate fish and bread. Would you like to hear the story? I can't hear you. Would you like to hear the story? Great, me too. Oh, oh. You know what time it is? It's time to hear. excited to be here. I got this great idea to surprise my friends by making them breakfast today. It's just the only thing I know how to make are sandwiches. Sandwiches are okay for breakfast, right? I have peanut butter. And what goes with peanut butter? Shout it out. It's jelly. 
Peanut butter and jelly go together. I've got a lot of sandwiches to make. Can you help me? Great. Pretend to make sandwiches with me. Set out two pieces of bread. One, two, good job. Now scoop up some peanut butter. Gloop, gloop. Then spread it on the bread. Swish, boosh, swish, boosh. Now scoop up some jelly. Scoop. Quick, spread it on the bread before it slides off. Slip, slop, slip, slop, slip, slop. Now stick the pieces together. We did it! We made a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. My friends are gonna be so excited. Who? Who? Hey, it's Ollie. Hello, Manny. Who? Who? Making peanut butter and jelly, are you? Hi, Ollie. I sure am. I can't wait to give my friends a surprise breakfast. Breakfast is great. It's true. I know of another surprise breakfast, too. Listen to this story. Just follow me through. Who? Who? Follow me through. Follow me through who? Oz got a Bible story for me and you. Hmm. Oh, hi, friends. I'm Justin the Mailman. I just finished a long walk delivering mail, and now I'm really hungry. It's almost my lunchtime. Hmm, what should I have for lunch today? Should I have spaghetti and meatballs? Or macaroni and cheese? Or peas and carrots? Oh, maybe I should have some fish. Did you know some people eat fish for breakfast? That reminds me of today's true story from the Bible. Do you want to hear it? Great. Let me just put the story mail in the mailbox. Today, we're going to talk about what happened after Easter. Easter started out sad. Jesus died and was put in a tomb. But did he stay in there? No! Jesus came back just like he said he would. Jesus is alive. Jesus is alive. Soon after that, some of Jesus' friends were fishing. All of a sudden, they saw Jesus standing on the beach. They were so excited to see him. Show me your excited face. Yes, good job. Jesus cooked fish and told his friends to come and have breakfast with him right there on the beach. They were so happy to be with their good friend Jesus again. They knew that Jesus loved them and that he would always be their friend, forever and ever. And there's more good news. Jesus loves you so much, and he wants to be your friend forever too, forever and ever. That is so awesome. Jesus is alive, and he wants to be your friend forever. Hey there, Ollie. Tell me, who wants to be your friend forever? Jesus wants to be my friend forever. Yes, it's true. Now let's hear it from you. Tell me, who wants to be your friend forever? Jesus wants to be my friend forever. That's the truth, friends. You better believe it. Bye. So there's your story, and it's all true. Jesus came back to see his friends, and he wants to be your friend forever, too. Thanks, Ollie. Goodbye to you. Hoo, hoo. Wow, 
Jesus made a special breakfast for his friends and told them that he wanted to be their friend forever. Jesus wants to be our friend forever too. I think I've got the story. Did you get it? If you did, say got it. Get it? Got it! Good! Peanut butter and jelly go together. But the best things that go together are my friend Jesus and me. See you next time. Bye! Jesus loves you and wants to be your friend forever too. Forever and ever. That is the best news. Jesus is alive and he wants to be your friend forever. Who wants to be your friend forever? Jesus wants to be my friend forever. Louder. Who wants to be your friend forever? Jesus wants to be my friend forever. Yes. Jesus wants to be my friend forever. Okay, friends. It's time to pray. Let's close our eyes and talk to God together. You ready? Hands up to the sky, big clap, and then bring them down to your heart. Close your eyes. Dear God, thank you for letting us hear how Jesus made a special breakfast for his friends. It shows us how much Jesus loves us and that he will truly always be with us forever and ever. I pray that each person here will choose to follow Jesus so he will be their friend forever too. We love you, God. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Bye. I am with you always. Matthew 28, 20. I am with you always. Matthew 28, 20.